perfect pitch on a perfect day in this stadium. Martin Tyler here, Alan Smith has joined me in the commentary area. MLS action, Chicago Fire against Toronto FC. Should be a good one. A lot of talk about the tactics these two managers are likely to employ beforehand. We'll soon find out. Now you've got your chance to check on the lineup for the home team. The system that we think they're going to go with is 4-5-1. That one striker will need a bit of support. Yeah, you do not want him to be left isolated. Otherwise, this formation will not work. The lineup for the away side. I think that back four is really important for them. They've got to be strong and solid, but they've got a bit of protection, haven't they? They have. They should have more than enough. I mean, they're all good defenders in their own rights, but uh, in front of them, they've got players who are going to be working really hard. Whether they could be a fit on the front foot, we'll wait and see. Thank you for joining us. Now get ready for a great match. So the first half about to begin. Nemanja Nikolic. Nikolic. He fancies his chances of getting past these players. Well read by the defender. Delgado. It's good attacking play this from them. Players arriving in the middle. He works so hard on his heading, he needs to do a bit more work, I think. Yeah, the keeper's waving that one bye-bye. Well, what a good ball into the middle. Well, there's nothing wrong with the ball in, but uh, just didn't time it properly and it's gone wide. He's cut that out well, well read. Michael Bradley, Delgado. Impressive in possession, passing's good, possibly dangerous. He's got skill with the ball, backing himself in these circumstances. And there's the interception. the ball out wide with time to assess the situation the chance to put in a decent cross but he's actually put in a wasteful one Delgado now Pozuelo well sitting back it's a bit of a policy here and letting the opposition come at them risky well, they set up to defend Allen, but they've conceded after all. Yeah, you can say that they invited that pressure, that the goal was coming. And now, really, they've got to change their attitude, haven't they? He is high and mighty with that goal. He was literally head and shoulders above everybody else there. And here is another angle on that goal.
And that has opened the scoring. 1 0 here. LFC, number 17, Josie Altidore. Frankowski. He's pinched it back again. A couple of teammates up in support. Too close to the keeper in the end. Bornstein. Plenty of space out wide, and they're going to use it. It's a bad decision here. A chance for the equaliser. Nico Gaita. Well, that looked a decent chance to attack until the player managed to read the pass. Break quickly when they get possession. Able to intercept here. Trying to thread a pass through, but not successful. A little surprised, the visitors with less possession here. But what you would say about this team is the way that they've... Had a go! Out in front of goal. Yeah, it's gone out of play, and it will be a throw from that uh, headed clearance. Morrow looking to use the full width of the pitch in this attack. Delgado. He's got the option to get in across now. Got the ball back. It's a good way to nick the ball back. Quick thinking. Well, he spotted the pass and cut it out. Strong, powerful clearance. Stopping the pass, getting through with a good piece of anticipation. Slipping it through. The target, players in the centre. It's come off the goalkeeper, still in play. Frankowski. Well, this crowd may be feeling that they got away with that one and they could come back now and get into this match. Nikolic. Nico Gaita. Frankowski. Bornstein. A chance to play it into the centre now. And they get it away. The crowd uh, may be expected a bit more, but two added minutes. Calvo. Promising forward play from them again. Well, how defensive have they become at the moment? Just sitting in their own half and letting the opposition pass the ball around in front of them. Maybe they feel they're not going to be hurt. Well, that's half-time at 1-0. I think that's a good performance, isn't it, Alan, from him in the first half? Yeah, it was a good first 45 minutes from the lad. Got the ball rolling with that goal, and he's been central to most of the good things his team has done. And here we go, the referee's blown his whistle, and we're off for the second half. Now Pozuelo, out to a wide man who's got room, hit in hard and low. That was a good crossing position, but not a good cross. Now Pozuelo, oh, it's close, Alan. Offside is given. He's quick enough. He doesn't need to do that. It's a good straight line by that defence. They've caught him now.
Schweinsteiger. Nico Gaita. Now it goes into the wider areas where they've got a winger waiting. Well, that was disappointing. They could have made more of it. That's very good shielding of the ball. And that's given away possession. Intercepted here. Manager thinking for the away side, time for a change. And they're looking good when they get the ball out wide, as they've done here. With good vision, Nico Gaitan. And it's in! The equalising goal! Well, a little look of celebration, but inwardly, he must be buzzing. Brilliant. The defenders seem to lose the concentration almost. They saw it coming from a long way out. Another angle on it here. It is uh, level. Both sides have scored here now. Chicago Fire, number 23. Substitution that the home side want to make. Pozuelo. Nothing wrong with the industry of the team. That little bit of inspiration lacking. Altidore! Attention, Rick Howard. Your wallet was found on the concourse. Please identify and claim your belongings at... Get Throw it to come. Well, that's what substitutes the four to be used. Chicago We've got one coming on now. Coming off the pitch. Number 13, Brent Ronico. To be replaced by... Number 16, Michael Azira. Substitution for Toronto FC. Looking to widen the play, really, widen the build up, but the ball's just run straight out over the touchline. Coming onto the pitch, number 21, Bornstein, Jonathan Osorio, Calvo. Good passing, probing. That could open them up. Really stretched to make the save. Top class. Corner played into the middle. It's broken down, and they'll have to try again. Read that well with the interception. So we're coming down now towards the last 15 minutes. Intercepted well. Held off the opponent well. Read the intentions. Well, it's been a frustrating day for these fans. They want a goal. They're urging the team on. Nikolic. Nicholas Gaitan. Possession is the name of the game for this team. Chance to put it in the box from here. Cross blocked by the first defender. And on the home bench, a substitute is clearly getting ready to come on. It's 82 minutes played now. Saw it coming, cut it out, good work.
now they've got the ball, what are they going to do with it? Excellent attacking play here. They could open up the opposition now. Gaetan! Obviously thought he'd really got a connect there, and he did. But maybe it just put his aim off. Yeah, I mean, a bit of contact maybe from the defender, but uh, you would have expected him to score from there. has given the ball away Morrow to Osorio the referee's had a good look and decided what he's seen from this uh, period of play to add on three minutes Chris Mavinga Pozuelo Josie Altidore and Toronto trying to win the game here in the club. Well, he's gone in a bit on the wild side. Well, decisive from the referee, no doubt in his mind that that was a yellow card. I don't know, you know, Martin, I, I know another referee might not book him for that offence. Put away, but not out of harm's way. That's the referee's final whistle, and the scores are level.